Hello, this is Brian Casey of The Imaging Wire. We are here at ECR 2025 in Vienna. And we're here with Julian Vollers of Siemens Healthineers and Robert Loritzen of Cerebru. Gentlemen, thanks for being with us today. Thank you very much, Brian. Thank you, Brian. Good to see you again. So uh, we're here to talk about a, a unique partnership between Siemens and Cerebru. Robert, can you give us the details on that? Yeah, thanks, Brian. Yeah, so. Cerebru has uh, implemented the smart protocol technology and we're implementing it in, in with the uh, Siemens Open Innovation Platform, specifically Open Workflow Platform for MRI workflow automation. And we're tailoring a protocol, adapting protocol real time, ultimately to get to a first time right imaging with the least possible complexity and, and, and resources. Awesome, that sounds great. So w as we know, Julian, MRI is, is probably the most complex medical imaging exam in, in radiology and you know it's it's incredibly powerful but it can take a lot of time to perform and you know we've got issues with with technology shortages and things like that what are some of the big trends that you see out there in radiology that this partnership is designed to address I mean I'm not really sure if I could call it a trend but as it has been always be difficult to conduct MR, MR, we historically have been at the forefront of automating every step along the line. And now with having Cerebria with us, now we're there, the critical path where we say when we do inline detection of certain things we can pick up, which directly can automize um, decisions in the, in, the, in the workflow, we're very happy to have Cerebria here to do this at this very nice brain example we have. Yeah, and so how is this partnership going to work? Are, are, are people, are, are MRI users in the field going to see anything from this or is it just all going to be kind of running in the background? Yeah, so actually what we do, we have a seamlessly integrated technology running on the MRI console. It detects within a few minutes of scanning a few 3-6 sequences. It detects critical diseases like infarctions. It detects intracranial hemorrhages and brain tumors. And it allows the tech to be notified and, and with a single click adapt the protocol on the device itself. So it's going to be quite visible and be operated by the technologies, but seamlessly on the on the existing MRI console as part of the, the Siemens uh, offering. And uh, and ultimately, of course, to improve the quality of care and, and simplify, as I said, the, the use of the machine uh, and, and available you know, mostly for, for, for healthcare practitioners around the world. Is this something that you see technologists using most often, or is it something that, most, that both radiologists and technologists would use? Well, I think that it's mainly a technologist tool. It's a technologist automation tool. Think of it as a companion that, that helps them uh, discover things that are critical and that can change the management of the patient, change certainly the procedure, the examination itself, to ensure first-time right imaging. And the downstream effect for the, the reading radiologist is that they get the appropriate imaging for differential diagnosis, so they don't have to recall the patient. They don't have to dis discover uh, missing sequences because, oh, there was a incidental tumor found, if they thought it was just a headache, but then it was a tumor and suddenly they have to recall the patient, do another exam, so this is the entire, it's really a companion tool to ensure the technologist is empowered to confidently perform the most appropriate examination first time right, and make sure the, the radiologist gets that exa examination available so they can, uh, they can uh, do the differential diagnosis. Very good, now Julian, we're, we're here in the Siemens booth, we've got some great technology behind us, can you talk about maybe some of the highlights in Siemens MR? here at ECR. Yeah, I mean, the highlight, of course, is here our flow system. And what we do with this partnership right now is like really, it's a bit of a paradigm shift. We are, we are really pushing an open innovation approach where we have now platform technology available um, where we can bring third-party technology like Serapio to the point where the technologist actually uses it directly at the scanner. So we're incorporating that technology, we're incorporating this AI technology to the scanner as close as it can get to the technologist to be able to come to the decisions as fast as possible to ultimately reduce um, the time the patient has to spend in the scanner. Perfect, well gentlemen, Robert Loritzen of Cerebru and Julian Vollers of Siemens Healthineers, thanks so much for being with us. Thank you very much, Brian. Thank you very much, Brian. Signing off from ECR 2025 in Vienna, my name is Brian Casey.